Okay, in this segment of Cool Tool, we have a very cool tool. It's the Exalta Color Camera. We want to take it a little bit farther and show you the process of why we think this is a cool tool. Basically, we're going to start out, we're going to take a picture of the paint. You'll put it up against the car and it'll take a picture, but a list of cars will come up. You want to cancel that out. You don't want to go there. You want to cancel it out and just go to a measure. And that means it's going to take a picture of the car using all the colors in the spectrum to pick from. I've been using the Exalta camera for over a year now, and trust me, I have gone from spraying other products to spraying the uh, this Exalta Chromax paint, and in over 500 mixes, and, and we have the documentation here, so every time we take a picture, we write down the numbers, so we, if the car might come back, or we, if we still have the number, and we can go back and refer to that, that picture we took. And of the 500 pictures or, that we've taken of colors, I may have checked maybe 20, just because I can't believe that it's so accurate. It's come down to where now I just take the picture, mix the paint, shoot the car. I never check it, I just paint it, so my faith in this camera is just immense. Now that we've taken the picture, I plug it into the computer and it'll pull up a color that it found throughout the whole spectrum of colors. So we have the two colors side by side. And what we're looking for is a color value less than 2.0. On this particular color, we've got a color value of 0.8, which is a really, really good color, especially with this gold color that we've chosen. Gold is a very difficult color to match. But not only that, we're gonna paint a bumper and we have to match the quarter panel. In all cases, if you're driving around town and you see cars that are like metallic, blue, silver, you'll notice if you look at the plastic bumper, their colors are always different. And there's a reason for that because the rear bumpers or the front bumpers are, are a plastic and then the panels on the car are steel or aluminum. And the color, you'll get a slight change no matter what. Even if you're painting them at the same time, the color changes a little bit from the plastic to the steel. So that's something that the industry's actually had to deal with. Okay, now we're ready to spray. Now, when we're in a booth um, spraying the bumper, you know, they recommend using a 1.4 fluid nozzle in, in your bank gun. I bumped it up to a 1.8 because with a 1.8 fluid nozzle, you can actually cover an entire panel, whether it be a bumper or a hood, and you can paint color the whole, the whole entire panel and fog it versus using a 1.4 where you can only do sections of it. Okay, now we're ready to spray. Now, for example, I've sprayed PPG and I've sprayed Axel Nobel, and if I'm using PPG or, or Axel Nobel, I'm gonna spend 20, 25 minutes in the booth spraying this car, but with this Chromax Pro water base, I'm in the booth, I've got this bumper painted in less than four minutes, and I'm done, I'm ready to clear. See, told you, under four minutes. Now. If you want to get some cars out, you need to have the Exalta camera and you need to have the Chromax paint. So here we go, we're, we're, we're done painting. We're just gonna put the bumper on. With the faith I have in this camera, I just know I'm not gonna have a problem here. So, and, and there we go, look, we have a perfect match. So there you have it. You've got your Exalta color match camera. You've got your Chromax Pro paint. You got a match made in heaven. You want to get things out, you gotta have these two cool tools. Jolly good show!